What's up guys, today we got a, a different kind of video, just pretty much like a random pickup video just from Christmas and New Year's. Just like four or five just random things from different companies, no one thing is from the same company. Just stuff I got for Christmas or I picked up Christmas money over Christmas and New Year's. So I've been posting some of this stuff, I, th I throw up a video and show you guys some of this stuff. Uh, I don't think anything in here, nothing is in here is supreme. Um, first thing I got. I got this off, I think I got this off Amazon, it was a, a members only jacket, kind of that old school kind of jacket, um, black, it's kind of like that uh, nylon, kind of windbreakerish almost material, not a super heavy jacket, definitely wearable in Florida when it's like cold, um, just just a classic jacket, I always wanted one, um, and just I never thought about buying one though, you know, I thought they were cool, it's just like I didn't, they're kind of like obscure, like no one really wears them, no one really buys them anymore, uh, at least like I think in America, but yeah, definitely a cool jacket. Got this button that goes across the neck, zips down all the way. Got a members only patch right here with a little pocket. Two pockets down here, just a nice casual jacket you can pretty much wear all the time. It has almost like a unique look that kind of like stands out. So simple, but like kind of a cool little jacket. Second thing I got was just a shirt. I got this for Christmas. Um, I've been wanting a quarter snack shirt for a while. They're making some cool stuff out there. Um, quarter snacks in the front in purple, and on the back, Got the little snowman on the back, kind of reminds you of that Jeezy shirt back in the day. Core snacks below it. Definitely just a cool little fun shirt. Um, they fit great too, great sizing on those, pretty much like Supreme sizing. And then I got these shoes for Christmas. I've been waiting for these for a while and said, hey, I'll get these for Christmas. Um, these are the Adidas Palace collaboration. Um, I got them in white, red stripes. Palace and Adidas on the insole. I think they just shoes look, shoes look like really nice. Just it almost has like a vintage style to it. It's kind of like the yellowish sole and then the old perforated middle and like the clean like smooth leather on the toe. They have a strong leather smell on these shoes too. Like it's almost like intoxicating. Um, definitely a comfortable shoe. I went true to size with these um, and I'm just really really happy with them. Even got some Palace Adidas branding on the tongue. This is pretty much like my go-to like Adidas shoe. I usually wear like superstars. I'm just like being like casual, black and white. But yeah, but these are a little bit more up there. A little stand out a little bit more. I think they look really like like casual, kind of fancy too. You can throw them on with like a button up or anything. And just like I've just really been feeling Adidas, Adidas lately. They've been putting out some good stuff. They're definitely taking over the kind of like the runner kind of scene. I think kind of like collaboration scene. Nike kind of has all the sports and the technical aspect, but. I think Adidas has taken over that casual sneaker line. And then the shoes I've been waiting for for a while. Another thing I just said, hey, like, get them for me for Christmas. Um, the Comme des Garçons uh, Converse is the second or the third collaboration. I think they did one before the Little Hearts. Second or third collaboration, not real sure. Converse play. Um, just, just a clean shoe. It's got a super glossy like white sole. Almost looks like painted on. White canvas upper. Of course you got the heart right there peeking out. Nothing on the insides and the high tops. You got the Converse star on the insides. Back, you got a little Converse branding right there. Uh, comfortable shoe, just Converse's, but it has that Comme des Garçons kind of touch to it. Um, I got them from Dover Street Market. Um, I got the Adidas's from uh, Dead Stock CA. I think it's the livestock shop. And uh, yeah, there's just shoes I really want for a while. I just like white. I think white's like my, like my thing right now. I just really dig how white shoes look. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Brown bottom fit true to size for me. I got them in a nine, they wear a nine and a half, and I got them in a nine Converse. And then I also got one more thing. I got about these, I just saw them laying over there. Um, I wear ABC pretty much every every day. Like it's like the only jeans I wear, the raw standard, um, uh, new standard petite. I got them in the raw, that dark denim. I always wear them if you see me and me with like a uh, selvage raw denim, they're the ABC new standard petites. But I also wanted like a light rinse wash. And um, I just like APC, like they're $200 jeans, but like you cannot, like the fit on those are just like perfect. I don't know what it is. Um, you might be like, well, the quality isn't that, well, the quality is like, I mean, it's like top notch to me, but it's basically the fit I'm paying for because jeans are so annoying to buy. Um, you just, they're usually baggy or they just look weird on the thighs. So it was hard for me to find like a new standard wash denim. And I really want some APCs, but they don't have this kind of wash and new standard petite. It's the standard petite one, I think, I'm pretty sure. It's a thinner cut. It's like um, at the ankle it's thinner cut and I think down past the knee it's a thinner cut. So I wasn't really sure. So I went to up a little bit. I usually get 29 raw. So I got 30 like my true like wash denim size and they fit perfect. Like I probably could wear a 29. Like it's, the only difference is they're not like skin tight. Just they fit around the ankle better and they look better on your shoes. Like it's not baggy over the shoe a lot. Um, 
wash denim, but the selvage. And just, yeah, like the fit on these, how the ankle is just cut tighter, is just really, um, these aren't selvage, by the way, I forgot, I didn't, not selvage denim, just ABC wash denim. But yeah, just like the fit on these is like really good. And plus I wanted that light wash. Sometimes I get bored of wearing all dark denim and it looks weird with like some types of shirts and some types of shoes. But yeah, these are a lot better if you want like a, a tighter fit around the ankle. So I definitely recommend these. Not super skinny compared to like the slim uh, new standard petite cut. Is a standard petite, a little bit thinner. Can you chill out, people? Jesus, on the on the ankle. So definitely these look better on boots and stuff. So they don't swallow everything. So yeah, really happy with these two. Um, yeah, those are all my Christmas, New Year's, New Year's Eve pickups. It's all the stuff I got pretty much, except like socks and like some like box debris, some stuff like that. But those are all the big pickups I got that you guys be interested in. Um, thanks guys for watching. Right now, Supreme's kind of like the end of the season. I'm not even paying attention right now. I'm saving for New York in February. Third week in February, I'm gonna go up to New York and we're gonna do some things up there. Go to the Supreme lineup. And yeah, that's probably the next video. I'll probably do like a thoughts and discussions on the new season when the lookbook drops, something like that. If I pick up, I doubt I'll be picking up anything. So my YouTube's gonna be pretty light. If you wanna follow me on Instagram or uh, Snapchat, I just started doing Snapchat. I do like kind of vlogging stuff on Snapchat. I don't really do stuff like that on, his, uh, on YouTube or Instagram. So yeah, if you guys wanna follow me on that, because right now I'm just trying to save a lot for New York so I can just go, go crazy, right? So yeah, thanks guys for watching. Always appreciate it. Uh, stay tuned for the next video.